Tonight is the first rose ceremony. The men are handing out the roses, and there is 12 girls and only nine guys. So three girls are going home tonight. I feel like a lot of women are nervous for tonight. There's only a few solid, like, solid couples. But myself, Haley, Hunter, Jill, Lace, basically everyone else could go home. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the first row ceremony of the summer here in paradise. Now, each of you came here looking for a second shot at love, and I really do hope that some of you are already on your way to finding it. Gentlemen, tonight, you'll be handing out the roses. Now, ladies, if there's someone else that you'd rather receive a rose from, you may choose to refuse the rose being offered to you but remember that by the end of the ceremony, if you have not received a rose, you will be going home. Three women will be leaving paradise tonight. Let's get started. Andrew. Teddy Wright. Teddy, I'm enjoying seeing your smiley face in our little moments. Teddy, will you accept this rose? Thank you. With my rose tonight, I want it to be something like a stepping stone. Teddy is a strong potential for me, and I can't wait to get down to the beach so I can like see her again. Brandon. Serene. Serene, thank you for being the be most beautiful and brightest joy since I've been in this beach. Serene Brooke Russell, will you accept my rose? Yes. Everyone is nervous because none of us know who's going to get roses and who isn't. Sierra, will you accept this rose? Absolutely. can seem strong, and then people change their minds, so I'm nervous. Shanae, I've been waiting a long time to get to know who you really are, and I'm excited to learn more. Will you accept this rose? Absolutely. Thank you. To go home on the first week, it would suck, because it's like I really did come here to try and find love again. Brittany, will you accept this rose? Of course. But Jacob is my only option for a rose tonight. Jacob. Jacob is still like the guy that like I want. Unlike Romeo, he doesn't have any red flags. I hope he realizes all the other girls in paradise are crazy and I am his one and only option. Place. I believe that you are as stunning as you are iconic. Place, <laughs> will you accept this rose? Love you. <laughs> Justin. Justin's rose is either going to go to Genevieve or to Victoria, but there's just no way to predict what's actually going to happen. Honestly, it would really suck to go home. And if I leave single, then it would be really upsetting. They come to make it through tonight. At all, Ava. I really do. Genevieve. Genevieve, will you accept this rule? I really like Justin. We had something the first night, so I feel like I can go into this next week like open-minded and see what happens. 
Johnny. I had such a good feeling about Johnny. I want to stay, obviously. I, I still don't know where his head is, and I know Victoria's super high in demand. She has Justin, apparently now Johnny, so she's a hot commodity. I don't know if that necessarily means that his rose is going there. Victoria. Victoria, will you accept this rose? Yes, thank you. Ladies, this is the final roast tonight. Romeo. Who is Romeo gonna give his roast to? Because I don't know who would accept it. Like, he just burned Jill so bad. And all of us other girls have seen him wrapped up in all the drama and we're like, you can stay over there. With Romeo, I still don't know if I trust him, but I think that him giving me his rose would go a long way in making amends. Jill? Jill, I want to start off by apologizing for how I treated you this week. I made a lot of mistakes, and I really, really hurt you. I want this rose to be a fresh opportunity for us to repair our relationship, or for you to explore new connections. Jill, will you accept this rose? Yes, because I know that nothing in paradise is guaranteed. Ladies, I'm sorry. If you did not receive a rose, please take a moment and say your goodbyes. I don't have that strong feelings about Romeo and Jill. It's not the rose that I wanted to get tonight. Like, I wanted Jacob. That's what I'm upset about. It just sucks going into something that you have a lot of hope for, and then all of a sudden, it's just ripped away from you within minutes. Somebody who didn't even deserve your kindness. He's Victoria's problem now, so I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> I've been on a bachelor and I'm in a paradise, and I still haven't gotten the roads. Like, I know I'm special, but nobody cares or wants to give me a dance. Well, at least now I get air conditioning, so who's laughing now?